Hey guys, welcome back. Another episode of Storytime with Mikey. <laughs> now, as many of you all know, who, especially if you watch my videos and you're looking at this ugly face right here, you'll notice that I'm missing a front tooth. And people may wonder, Mikey, why are you missing a tooth? Maybe not, but I have nothing else to talk about right now. <laughs> And some people might say, well, you should have been brushing your teeth. This is the first ad first adult tooth I ever lost. It was back in 2016, and it was not because of dental hygiene. I lost some over here because of dental hygiene. On my back, on, on my, some back teeth. Two bicuspids. <laughs> but, um, this tooth was lost during my one and only fight. <laughs> yes, this fat idiot got in a fight in 2016. And you may be wondering, Mikey, why'd you get in a fight? Who'd you fight? Did you win? I will answer all those questions right now. I got in a fight in 2016 because I have a, a, a young baby baby cousin named Monterius, who is He's mixed. His mother's white, his father's black. And he was called the N-word with a hard ER. And while he was in front of me, I was walking him to the local st uh, store to get some snacks. And a very racist man called him that word. Now, I told the guy to stop it, shut his mouth, and go on about his business. But he continued. He continued to call my, my little baby cousin the N-word. He, he then also called me a N-word lover because he, this is a member of my family and I'm defending him. So I did what any self-respecting person would do to defend his family and anybody in the African-American community. I grabbed him and we got into a fight. I mean, I don't, for what I heard, it didn't last long. Because I'm the kind of person when I get into a fight, I black out. Meaning, I don't remember what I do at all. And I don't know nothing until I wake back up. And by wake up, I mean until I finally come back to my senses and I'm aware of what's going on around me. <clears throat> and when I came, when I came back to my senses, I, I noticed I was missing a tooth. I had got my tooth knocked out. But to be fair, I think the guy who I who I got in a fight with took the worser end of the of that sword. Bro he, he got a broken jaw, broken arm, broken nose, both his eyes were blacked, he had a concussion. Apparently I shoved him so hard that he fell backwards and he bashed his head against the, the roadside curb. Uh, I did a number on him. Knocked him out. <laughs> and all he did was knock out my tooth. One little tooth. Because I don't condone violence at all. But I will not stand for a person to attack my family. And I definitely will not stand for someone to attack somebody just because of the color of their skin. It's sick. It's dehumanizing. It's pure, flat out racism. And I did what I thought was necessary. And that's my throwback story. The time that this fat ass got into a fight because he, I was going to stand up for what was right. I was not going to let that guy just stand there and say that word. And then also insult me. I don't stand for that. But at least at the end of the day, he had to eat his, his food through a straw. He, had, he couldn't move his arm. He couldn't barely see because his eyes were swollen shut. And I just had to go to the dentist and get that uh, gum, my, get my gum taken care of because of where the tooth got knocked out. I think I, I think I did pretty well for my first and only fight. I don't plan on getting any more fights because that was... I had a terrible headache when I came to because whenever I lose my temper, I always get a headache. Especially when my temper causes me to lash out in a violent manner. And I tend to like, I like to stay like this. Typically if I get mad, I, I, I try to do no more than yell and shout if I have to. So, thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.